Hello, welcome to I Love Stocks. Please hit that like button and ring that bell for future updates. But I want to talk about a little penny stock in here in the EV department, Tantec. Tantec Shanghai Motors, they just had a direct offering of 10 million. Direct offering, so I figured that's going to be closing up pretty soon. Let's see if we can find the date in here. 2020th, they had the direct offering, 165 a share. So Sunday, I said this thing could probably bounce back to 165 a share, and it sure did. And then it was, um, they have the warrants are going to be exercised at 181. So I think we've achieved that level too. Let's go ahead and look at the chart. But I think we're going to be closing on this pretty soon. I have to kind of look down here and find out. But let's go ahead and go straight to the chart. We had a nice little one-year run all the way up to a year high of about 365. And right now, pre-market, we're at 242. So let's go ahead and pull this up to a 20-day. Look at the 20-day and try to find the support. We did call this bottom here. We were looking for on the watch list for something that had a real hard sell-off. This was the one. So we did have our 50% retracement that I mentioned in the in the uh, Saturday Saturday report and so now we're sitting right about oh, 243 and I have a 236 support so I'm thinking I have two lower supports if it does pull back to that but let's look at the daily one minute and see if I can catch anything different here yeah I'd like to see it stay in this channel we had an ascending triangle breakout right here that support held and then we had this like see it come back to that this morning and i always talk about that horizontal line that's at 223 so i want to consider that a pretty solid support if it pulls back to 223 we could have a double bottom bounce or if it pulls back to this lower support right here at the 50 percent right around two dollars would be a, a a pretty strong buy at the third support level and then you got this one right down here where we had that other chart pattern, and that's right around 184. So either one of these three would be probably ideal. I'm going to go ahead and put this in here because I like this one right here for a double bottom. And that's going to be right here for the double bottom play at 223, and then a strong buy at 201. And then if that fails, you can add on to this 184 and bring it back up to these resistance levels. This is T-A-N-H. This is just kind of how I'm looking at it today. I want to see if I can play back up to resistance. But you see this is a very solid support. This channel right in here where you had this ascending triangle. So that 223 seems like a pretty good double bottom strong buy to bring it back up and scalp it maybe to 253 or go long if you're really looking for a long position and it does pull back to like 184 to two dollars that's where i'd go in swing it long t-a-n-h i like it nice call saturday and then we had that good uh run yesterday so this is i love stocks always remember we have our little icons over here on the right this brings you to our twitter page if you're Linked up to Twitter, hit that icon and hit that follow button. Miss Vegas, very good tape reader. She's always posting alerts in here, and a lot of stuff she alerts is because she's reading tape. So keep that in mind when you're in here posting alerts and watching us. Then we also have our stock twits. I want to wish everybody a good day. I did a video this morning, kind of a pre-watch list. If you want to watch it also, you can go ahead and follow up. We do have it here on our video side, and you can see all of our videos that come up through here, and you can hit them too. So this is I Love Stocks. Let's have a good day.